I'm Grits, and this is your AIM News. I'm sure you're all wondering where a lot of our cast members and why Alex is actually on set, but this evening it appears that the entire cast is on strike, and they're protesting the unfair working conditions of Friday's Live. All right, good evening. I'm Alex Lumley, and Grits, that is simply not true. They are quite upset over the lack of health care options, unsafe working conditions, and the fact that I make the most money on cast. They think it's unfair. I think it's because I'm the best and most talented. But the show must go on, and that's why I brought you on, Alex. You're the scab, and you'll stick with me until they come crawling back to the soles of my feet. Grits, for the last time, I am not a scab. I am your head writer. Alex, while Lauren is gone, you're whatever I need you to be. And in fact, how about a masseuse? Get your nasty ass dirty foot off my desk and away from my face. Everyone else, including Lauren, will be back next week. They are not on strike, and you, my friend, don't get paid a dime. That's right, Alex. Get, get the audience on our side. Grits, read my lips. I, I need you to understand this. You do not get paid. Of course I don't get paid at all. The fact that they're striking makes no sense. <laughs> I knew I should have had more beers before this. <laughs> Some positive news for Donald Trump. A Florida woman made a very generous donation to the Donald, protesting his rhetoric by sending him her pubic hair. Her pubic hair. <laughs> she sent a note that said, I'm not able to email you the right part, so I've included the next best thing, cheers. Well, still not even close to the hairiest situation Donald Trump's campaign has faced this election. Disgraced swimmer Ryan Lochte is back in the news for not knowing what Yom Kippur is and confusing it with Canadian Thanksgiving. You know, as a Jew, this really upsets me. Ryan Lochte, how dare you compare Jews to Canadians? All right, haven't we been through enough as a people? My God. Uh, Chris? Yeah, buddy. I really think we should farther discuss why it is you think everyone is on strike. Okay, well. Fair wages, equal pay. Grit should not make more than me. Fair wages, equal pay. Grit should not make more than me. <sighs> it's not my fault I'm so amazing. I'm sorry. Wow, you have a bigger ego than I do, and I really thought that was impossible, so kudos to you. <laughs> and Gabby, you need to stop this nonsense. Grits does not make more money than anyone. Do you really think I would let him out of the whole to make more money than anyone? I mean, you let it happen, so. Alex, we all want to know how much Grits is making. Otherwise, I'm taking away what's left of your precious cash. Okay, Gabby, stop bothering Alex. I will tell you how much. I make 25. 25, see? 25 what? 25. 25 cents. Richard threw, to me at, threw this at me last week for nagging him. <sighs> okay. See, Gabby, it's all a misunderstanding. It means nothing, he makes nothing. Now please stop. Mr. That Green. is more than 25 times any of us on this cast make. I'm just that great. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, Gabby, come back. No. I am not living in a world where Grits makes more money than me. I'm just that talented, I can't help it. Okay, I'm sad to report that that's all the time we have tonight. He is selfish and obsessed with himself. And he gives lousy foot massages. That's not what his mom said last night. <laughs> and this has been your A-News. Good night, everyone. Happy Halloween. Ow!